Good morning friends, this is Jimmy Singh, broker owner of Supermax Realty, 519-933-2559. Uh, people often ask me how's the market. So in this small video, I'm going to discuss a mid-market analysis for London St. Thomas as of July 2020. Uh, and then I'll also discuss you know, how our market fared in June of 2020. So as of mid of this month, uh, what happened is, you know, our province already is in stage two of reopening. And uh, after pandemic induced delay, uh, you know, typically spring market is the fastest market. But all that things, you know, got postponed till summer market. And what I have seen in June, you know, first week started a little slow. But by the end of June, everything was, you know, flying off the shelves. And, uh, you know, it's increasing of consumer confidence and people are now confident about their health and they're moving about their, you know, buying houses and, you know, 62 percent houses last month, you know, were sold uh, full asking or over asking price as well. So as of July 14th, 2020, I did some research in the morning and uh, in London, 301 homes were sold. And out of 301 homes, 215 are detached homes, 44 were townhouses, 14 were semi-detached, and 28 homes were apartments. And uh, if I break it down the market into starting home, uh, mid-tier or high-end or luxury, so let's say, you know, starting home is between less than 450,000 homes. Out of 301, 154 homes that were sold they are from you know starting price points which is less than 450 and if i go mid-tier market which is between 450 to 650 we have 91 sales as of mid july and if i see you know high-end homes or what we call luxury homes in london 650 plus up to million or over million uh, 55 percent uh, you know 55 homes were 650 plus so as you can see, if you crunch the numbers, like roughly 80% sales, which are happening in the last 15 days, they're all the homes less than 650 or 50% were less than 450. And, uh, you know, supply is still very, very tight. And uh, if you, uh, you know, if you're not sure what's happening in your local market, let's say you live in Hyde Park, you live in Byron, uh, you live in Andover Trails, Westmount, Sunningdale, all, you know, it's very small micro markets in London. So what's happening in Hyde Park might not be reflected what's happening in, uh, let's say, Victoria on the River or Cedar Hollow. So if you want, you know, uh, all these details, you're most welcome to reach me directly at 519-933-2559 uh, for a free uh, market, you know, valuation. And if we talk about June, uh, that is the last month, you know, that is the record. If, you know, we talk about London St. Thomas Real Estate Board, they said they've been tracking data since 1978. And this June was the best, you know, since they start tracking, you know, since 1978. And total homes sold were 1188 homes, uh, which are roughly 13.8% higher as compared to last, uh, you know, year. And if we say the prices, uh, since last year, the prices have risen 19.3%. And the average sale price in London right now is hovering around 486,372. And uh, if we say St. Thomas, uh, the average price is close to right now $382,862, which is 8.5% higher as compared to June of 2019. And uh, if we break down London, uh, London East have a growth of 16.5%. And the average price in East London right now is 378880 And if we talk about North London, Average price right now is 563,950 and the growth is 15.6%. And the South London prices have jumped 24.1% as compared to last year. And right now the average price in South is 500,450. Uh, see, uh, the London St. Thomas board, they don't count uh, London West as a separate you know, sub uh, mar market. They just take, you know, West and add it to South London and uh, some portion into North London, right? And um, if we talk about Strathroy, uh, the prices are up 14.7% and the average price in Strathroy is $425,277. And uh, 
as an agent what i do is when clients call me jimmy is it a good time to buy and sell i always look at supply and demand so by end of june our supply was only 1.3 percent uh, of the inventory so basically uh, if we put all the houses up in the market within 1.3 months they'll be all sold out and we don't have any houses to sell and that you know supply is lowest for the last 10 years and the other important uh, parameter or you know uh, the ratio i look for is selling to listing ratios and selling to ratio listing ratio basically is close to 78.5% which shows we are in a very hot sellers market i feel sorry for the buyers but chances are if you're in a starting market let's say 450 you will be going in multiple offers left and right and uh, obviously if you're in a mid tier market between 450 to 650 I still see a lot of action because listings are real, real tight. So guys, if you're looking to sell your property and uh, you want aggressive marketing plans, you know, f and, uh, you know, to attract out of town buyers, call us. We have, you know, we've been helping our clients for last 15 years, promote their properties to GTA buyers, out of town buyers, and we have a big database for that, right? So call me. My number is 519-933-2559. Or if you have a single family home and you're looking for good tenants, give us a call. If you have a townhouse, you have a detached house and you want qualified tenants in your property, uh, reach me at 519-933-2559 or you can have a free valuation just by visiting my website www.supermaxrealty.ca and uh, as far as the Bank of Canada overnight rate, it's still quarter points like 0 0.25, right? So interest is really, really cheap. And if we talk about prime right now, prime is hovering around 2.45 still. And uh, what I found in June, there's like lots of rush with the buyers because they want to beat the deadline for CMHC changes, which are coming to effect first of uh, June. And uh, that brought a lot of buyers who are sitting on the sideline. They said, you know what, by waiting, I'm just, you know, paying more like 30, 40,000. Let's, let's jump into it. It's still cheaper than renting. So if you have a solid job, you will do very well. And uh, second thing is, you know, my only concern is a little bit by the time September comes when the free money dries, let's say, you know, all the, uh, you know, government right now is giving check for people who lost their jobs or, you know, there's like roughly 14% people who deferred their mortgage payments. Uh, not sure how the market is going to pan out. So September is probably a month to watch out. Uh, but again, I'm very bullish. I think, you know, we still have a lot of catching up to do in following weeks or months and uh, we will do fine. So, you know, if you have any questions, call me. My name is Jimmy, 519-933-2559 and uh, have a blessed day. Thank you very much.